What is it about Bitcoin that causes you to conclude it is not a security? Well, there's it, uh, one is there's no group of individuals in the middle. Right, it's there's decentralized. There's no group of individuals in the middle. Right. That are My point is it is not reasonable to fail to provide clarity, to provide the definition of exactly where on this continuum you have a sufficient common enterprise that it qualifies as a security and where you don't. You've said Bitcoin doesn't. Some of your colleagues have said Ethereum doesn't. But a reasonable developer who wants to comply with this doesn't know where that line is drawn. So a common enterprise. I think about a group of individuals in the middle. That developer is in the middle and the investing public's betting on them, counting on them, even if the token might be on a thousand computers. That's not what the Supreme Court's looking at. It's not about the token being on a thousand computers. It's just like a group of developers but, in the middle. But there's